everyone, Miss Terry here. It's time to do our next art projects. Art project. X is for X-ray. And there it is. X is for X-ray. Let's see what we have in our bag with the materials in it. So we have a big white piece of paper. We have a big X. Oh, you probably can't see that, can you? A big X. And some Q-tips to build our X-ray. So let's look at what X-rays look like. So this is an X-ray. It's a picture of your bones that doctors will use to figure out if you need some medical care. If you need some help from a doctor, they will check out pictures of your bones. That is called an X-ray and that's what we're making today. So this is what it looks like. And Miss Terry is gonna start by gluing on that X. So we're gonna get that X on. I'm gonna take out my starter kit and I'm gonna use my school glue today. That will work better with our Q-tips. So here's our school glue. I'm gonna start by making an X with my glue. And I'm gonna put my big black X right on top of that. Now, if you need to pause and work that out before we move on, go ahead and hit pause or stop. Your grown up can help, and then we can continue on when you're ready. Now, it's time to get those Q tips on to build our bone x ray. We're going to get those bones on there. So, I'm going to make another X on top of my black X with my school glue, starting at the top, just like if we were going to write an X. There we go. Alrighty, now I get to stick my bones, my Q-tip bones, right on top of that. Oops. Mm. Keep dropping the bones. I hope I don't break them. All right, here we go. <clears throat> now I can see I put a little more glue than I needed, but it'll dry, don't worry. And there you have it. I put my four bones on there. I have my X's for X-ray. And now I am going to take my black crayon so you're going to want to take your crayon out of there or out of your starter kit or if you have, um, if your grown up has a marker, that could work as well. <clears throat> you can do this on your own or you can have the grown up help you. You can also have your grown up use pencil or a highlighter. Highlighters are great. You can have your grown up use a highlighter pen like one of these and they can write these words, X is for X-ray, and then you can trace over the top of it. Pretty fun. So um, I won't model that. Grown-ups, use your highlighter. Have your child trace over the highlighter. Maybe I will show you that. We're going to tip this down. I'm going to show you what that looks like. So I'm going to write X is for X-ray with my highlighter pen. X is actually didn't do a normal X. You probably want to do it like this, do it the right way. X is for X-ray right at the bottom. Now, after you do that, then your child can take the black crayon and write over the top of the highlighter. So now I'm going to write, there's the highlighter. Now the, your child can write over the top, can trace all those letters so they can be the one to write the words. I'm going to show you how that works. I'm going to go right over the top of the green highlighter. X is for X-ray. It's great practice at tracing. And there you have it. I traced right over the top of the highlighter. All right, thanks for joining me and 
Good luck. Oh, can I see? You can put me on pause for a second. I'd like to see your x-ray with your traced letters on it. Put me on pause for a second and then you can show me. Looking good. Thank you. We'll see you later. Bye now.